How's it going, everybody? This is Golden Bolt, and welcome back for some more Star Fox Adventures, and welcome to what I like to call Filler Week, which is a week before, uh, po week after Pokemon Gold, and before the next LP, which is, uh, I don't have the ability to record right now. So, we're jumping back into the Filler LP Star Fox Adventures. If you remember, months ago, we completed Dark Ice Mines here and opened up the gate. Uh, that totally looked like a scarab, that's weird. And, uh, we opened up the gate here to go fight the boss of Dark Ice Mines and get ourselves a spellstone. So, we're going to go do that. What a high note to come back on. Also, if you notice why my health is not full, the instant I came back into the game, one of those stupid snake bursters came out and hit me. The instant! Those are, like, my least favorite enemy in any type of video game ever. And, uh... Also, this quality is probably a little better than it was before, but not the best it's going to eventually get to. Second half of Filler Week, it's going to be highly improved. Mainly because I'll have a Wii at that point, and, uh... My HD PVR functions a lot better with that, and who is that? Or I guess I should say, what is that a little bit more, shouldn't I? What? How did you get over there? Dang it, Tricky. Stop breaking physics. Look at that thing. Would you look at this? Look at that. That is one... Icy frozen dragon. But wait, did you see that? I saw it. Did you see it? What is in his hand there? Looks like the spell stone. We found ourselves a spell stone. Well, this thing is frozen. Oh, wait, before I do this, I'm actually going to. Um, gotta get back into playing this game. <laughs> it's, uh, been a long time. We're gonna have to use, have Tricky use flame and make sure you've got that fire blast uh, up on Y. He's got the spell stone! Yes, you did see that right. He did just eat the spellstone. This is boss Galvin. He's uh, he's not too hard of a boss here. Um, what you're what you're going to try and do to start off here? Um, wait for him to pause there for a little bit. Of course, we're kind of strafing right now, which is a bit unfortunate. But I okay, there we go. Gonna want to go after his ow his tail because, as you can see, that's a weak spot there. So once he just beat the crap out of his tail. And, once you do, this is a very, it's a very simple boss mechanics, a lot of it actually is dodging what he does, and, oh, game over, Fox is eaten, the end. Just kidding, this brings us to another phase, we actually, that, he actually has a spell stone in his little uvula thing right there. So, why not just beat the crap out of it, yeah, that's, that's good. Actually, it would have been a lot smarter if I would have shot it, but hey, whatever. And... We're alive, yay! And, alright, the, bo the boss is though, it is not complete though. As you can see, there is a slit in his chest, which brings us to uh, part two of this fight. Now, 90% of this, this section of this fight is dodging him. Um, he eventually is going to get an opening um, in which you're going to fire a, a, bla fire a fire blast into his chest opening there. That is not it, and ow. Ow, oh, he smacked me. Tricky, get out of the freaking way. That is not... That is not it, I believe he's about, when he's about to breathe fire. He like, he does a little bit of a charge up thing. Tricky is all up in the way. It does kinda, it does... Ow, god, he keeps smacking me with his hand. I really hate that Tricky just stands there and pins you in. That's really not cool. Look at him, he's just... He's just stuck there, in the way. Come on, Galbon. Uh, do your little thing. I'm gonna see if I can spin him a little bit so I have more room to move around. Man, I'm running out of staff energy. Not cool, game, come on. There it is. And you hit him there, and he starts to smoke. Shut up, Tricky, I'm not waiting for you. Wait for me. What an idiot. So it looks like I was just kind of shooting pointlessly for a while. But hey, uh, there's enough items around 
All you really need to do is shoot him. Uh, hit it. It looks like he hit it four times, and he is gone. Looks like I need, I'm going to... Ow! Need some more staff energy. All right, time to go. Time to abandon ship for a minute and get ourselves some uh, health. And get ourselves some staff energy. Once you do that, though, he is not pleased with you. Uh, let me tell you now. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh! Going to make a lot of use of your X dodge rolls here, but tricky man, he is annoying in this. He really serves zero purpose, and he really just is kind of ow is there to pin you in. Dang it! See, look, I can't even. It's either get hit by that guy's fist or get stuck by Tricky. Tricky is seriously the most useless companion ever, and boom, heartburn. I don't know if you heard that my uh, wave bird controller battery pack thing snapped back in, but anyway. Back in the stomach. Time to beat the crap out of this again. Actually, I'm going to be smart this time and shoot it. And there we go. And once again... Fox is now safe, and the spell stone is in our possession, but as I said once again... Yeah, exactly, Fox. That is my thoughts exactly. He has to be vomited out. This is traumatizing. must forgive your father. You must work together to lead the Snowhorn tribe against Scales instead of fighting each other. I will, Fox. Because of you, my people shall no longer live as slaves. Okay, we'll see you soon. We gotta take this spellstone back to the planet. All right, and if you saw that, talking to Belina Tay at the end there, uh, we are now have a spell stone, giant spell stone, in the center of our shut up tricky in the uh, center of our interface there, as well as a new set of health. So now we die less, yay! Uh, even and we also have the Bay Farm Dad holder, so we're we're definitely fine. And time to return to orbit. All right, tricky, get in there and throw up because you're going to, because I'm gonna do barrel rolls like crazy because of that fight. Alright. It's like the most unsafe place for Tricky to sit. Of all places in the R-Wing, that's probably the least, you know, helpful for him. Alright, and now that we've, uh, cleared through Dark Ice Mines there, it is time to return to Dinosaur Planet. Great job, Fox! You saved the Snow Hall tribe and collected the Spell Stone. But it's not over yet. You need to return the spellstone to the Force Point Temple. Happy has indicated that it is located beyond Moon Mountain Pass. I'm sure the Thorntails can point you in the right direction. Pepper out! Moon Mountain? So like Mount Moon? We're going back to Mount Moon. And anyway, as we normally do on our way to Dinosaur Planet, we only have to fly through one gold ring. This never changes, by the way. And, uh, yeah, good stuff. Another R-Wing level. Actually, it's the same R-Wing level. I hope you get sick, Tricky. I hope you get sick. I still don't understand why there are ships. Are these, I guess they're, tight. I guess they would be scales ships, but still. It's double lasers, and we're done. Okay. The force field is open. He's so annoying. Pepper's got a dumb voice. And he aged terribly, by the way. If you look at this game and then Star Fox Assault, which is the sequel to it... Shut up, Slippy. Um, he aged horribly. Ah. Oh, well. Tried to do a sweet roll into there. I, I really did, probably didn't even need to. Bombed. Okay. I was going to stop, Peppy. I'm glad you reminded me. Sweet, I just rolled into these guys. Yay for being rusty! Alright. You go! 
got to help us. Those horrible shark claws put out our lovely beacons, and it gets too dark at night. We be scared of the dark. <laughs> okay, okay, stop crying. I'll see what I can do. Don't forget about the spellstone, Fox. You have to return it to the first point temple. Thanks, Peppy. Uh, thanks for reminding me I have terrible short-term memory. Now, um, uh, as he said, the, um, the beacons have gone out. Now, remember, it does rain here, so that's totally a possibility. The thorn tails are just stupid. <laughs> Alright, so we're actually gonna wanna, first off, go uh, down here because one of the beacons... Oh, wait, that gate's already open. Never mind. Sweet. One of the beacons is already, uh... Is, is through that gate. Alright, so... In order to relight these beacons, we have to go over to this tree here, which when you hit it, brings down these weird little fire things. And once... and... wow, I'm seriously like... Am I dying in the cutscene? That was awesome. This is a fireweed. Yes, we're going to need to collect three fireweeds because there are only three beacons, apparently, that keep the light on. You stupid... Put the fire out. Whatever. It's cool to run around and catch fireweeds with f on fire. Alright, we got our three fireweeds. It is time to go relight these beacons. Alright. As you can see, the first one is up there. Uh, one is over here, one is by where the um, warp stone is, and uh, the other is through that gate, as I was saying. Place fireweed, and we're going to use our only new ability, which is Tricky's Flame. Do it, Tricky. Don't be stupid. Alright, great. That's one. Time to move on to the other ones. There's that stupid keys. I'm going to call it keys forever. Whatever. I don't care. Um, yeah, the other one is in here by where the warp stone is, as I said. I hope you guys are glad also that uh, Star Fox Adventures is coming back. I was kind of excited to get back into it. Brought me back to the beginning of the semester. Or the beginning of the school year, not really semester. Because that's kind of when I started. It was like in September. I don't even remember. Alright. The other beacon is over here. So we're going to put the fireweed here. And once again, use Tricky's Flame. He's probably gonna get hungry soon. Whatever. You can starve, Tricky, for all I care. Look at him. Is he staring at us? Are you staring at me? He is. What a creeper. You, got, you gotta say, if I was a Thorntail, I would be thoroughly creeped out by that guy just trying to live my life and I, I turn around and giant stone watching you. That stone would have a horrible time trying to people watch because anytime he tried to just glance at somebody, everyone would know. Alright, so, um... Stupid mushrooms. Why are these- why are those even there? And the last beacon? Oop, there's actually a big spot. What do we got here? Find secret. Why is that- ew, gross tricky. You got dang, like awkwardly close to that thorn tail, whatever. Hey, another bay farm dad. Fantastic. What do I have, like seven of these now? Oh, and now you're hungry, aren't you tricky? Where are my stupid grub tubs? Eat them and be happy then. Because I know otherwise you'd complain and be like, mm, I can't eat. Well, I'm glad you're stuffed. Let's place the last fireweed. And... What are you talking about? Look at what? I already found it. What are you smoking, Tricky? The beacons mean so much to my tribe. Please take this. I believe it will help you on your quest. Alright, and with that... Somehow, Thorntails have opposable thumbs to hold on to keys. This is the Moon Pass key. It will allow you to open the gateway that leads to the Volcano Force Point Temple. Doesn't that just sound like the best name ever? Okay, I'm going to the Volcano Force Point Temple. Actually, I'm pretty sure we need some of these. Might as well get them anyway. Just in case. Um, I'm almost... I know we need these, actually, to get to the next area. We might as well just grab them. Whatever, five's good. Alright, now it's time to head off to Moon Mountain Pass. We're probably going to get started on our way there, and then I'll end off the part and uh, see you guys again tomorrow with more Star Fox Adventures. Also, I'd like to uh, once again thank everybody for watching Pokemon Gold, and uh, thank you also for potentially, if you're one of the people who decided to come back to this. However, uh, 
the summer LP is going to be great. Also, um, please leave a comment whether or not you'd like to see this throughout the summer. I have, I've thought about doing this on the weekends during the summer, but uh, yeah, go ahead and leave me a comment whether or not you'd like that, or just like to see the summer LP. I left a hint on the end of the Pokemon Gold finale if you'd like to take a look there and get your ideas going. And yeah, I think we're actually going to end off here. So, uh, I don't really, I think this is a good time to do it. We'll, uh, start taking on Moon Mountain Pass here in the next episode. So, yeah, guys, um, thanks for coming back to Star Fox Adventures. It was really exciting for me to come back here and, uh, see Fox and, uh, stupid Tricky again. By the way. This hurts me more than it hurts you. Actually, it hurts you way more than it hurts me. Anyway, guys, from me to you, have a very nice day, and I will see you guys next time.